Alright, I'm putting the electrodes on. Uh, you do one in the center of the muscle, another one on the end of the muscle. For now, I'm targeting the bicep. And then a third one, this will be the ground electrode. And I'm going to put it on a bony surface like my elbow. color-coded leads. Plug in my battery. Alright, so we turn the lights off so you can actually see the LED. Um, and I'm going to flex and it'll turn on every time I flex. So I'm flexing, not flexing. Flexing, not flexing. Flexing, not flexing. Alright, so this is how the circuit works. Uh, the inputs coming from my muscle are running on these leads. They're sent to this instrumentation amp. Uh, this amplifies it by 10, and you can, it's, you know, high impedance, so you can just send signals in there. Then goes to these two uh, chips right here are making up a bandpass, filters out low frequency noise and high frequency noise. Um, if you want to find actual cutoffs you can look online. This last stage right here is a final amplification um, after we filter for noise. We filter before we amplify mainly just so we don't amplify the noise as well. And then right here I have uh, a diode and then a resistor and a cap in parallel with the diode and uh, that's just a peak detector so that this will be a more fluid it'll stay on instead of just going on and off whenever I flex my muscle. Uh, you'll notice I only have one battery over here um, and yet I'm using a plus nine and minus nine rail. Uh, that's because of this chip on the far left it's a Maxim 1044 this thing uh, takes a plus 9 voltage and it uh, spits out a minus 9 and that way I can use uh, one battery and get plus 9 and minus 9 volts and that's how it works so while this might not seem very uh, awesome right now the next step is to replace this LED and have this uh, peak detector outputting to a motor driver and this will be just the command signal so whenever you flex your muscle, it'll send this command voltage to a motor driver, turn on a motor, and then that's the basis for some kind of exoskeleton, which I'm trying to build right now.